Come on, Smokey, do your thing for the vlog. <laughs> there we go. And we're at Puzzle Ranch. This is Ab His name's Abner, by the way. People always try to call me on Facebook while I'm trying to record vlogs. <laughs> so rude. And this is Cameron. Hi, how are you? So they're teaching me about Puzzle Ranch and why they got it started. So yeah, how, like, how did y'all get it started? So we have four sons with autism mm -hmm. and we moved, um, got this property for them and uh, for our family, just have like a more therapeutic lifestyle. Mm -hmm. And then it just kind of grew where we decided we wanted to invite other families that had similar challenges to come in and um, enjoy the outdoors, spend time with the animals and spend time outside, make memories, be a cowboy. They have a big movie projector out here. So y'all usually, when y'all do the movie nights, it's like a lot of people, like this whole yeah, place will be filled up. Yeah. Nice, nice. Y'all like do the marshmallows yeah. and. Some marshmallows. <laughs> no. I know that looks nice when it's at night. Oh yeah. And yeah. then like these little oh, lights yeah. be like lit up. I'm sure. Yeah. yeah. It's really festive. We have the gym mine in there. And you can like mine for little pieces of gold. Yeah, yeah, like the sand of the gold and find the gems. Mhm. Mm the regular. You can see all inside. Let's go. That's. I like saying that. That's how <laughs> One of my catchphrases. Are you catchphrases? Yeah. <laughs> this right here is going to be a barbershop? Yeah, barbershop, a uh, sensory room, and a uh, general store. This will be a breakfast area, so we have cabin. They have a swing. Just so y'all know, Abner built all of this stuff. I think that's so cool when I meet people that actually build, because we do live in a digital world now, yeah. so like the people that know how to do hands-on stuff is getting rare. So like, yeah. Yeah. like the bathroom, everything custom made by him. That's yeah. very impressive. Mm -hmm. yeah. Oh, this is like chickens. Mm -hmm. Chicken. Wait, this says jail. <laughs> For the chickens. Oh, <laughs> oh no, they're in jail. <laughs> Ready to have an immersive experience with the animals. Okay. Is this a goat? This is a goat. Yep. This is it was at this moment I knew. Oh my God. <laughs> I am surrounded by animals. This is a Nigerian dwarf goat. This is uh, Ferdinand. <laughs> That's a cow. Baby cat. A yep. And this is Rudolph. He's our baby goat. Baby goat. Yep. What kind He's of animal is that? the daddy goat of the Nigerian dad. So Bessie is the mom, and then there's Rudolph, and then uh, Houdini. And, and these are silky chickens. Mm. Just a variety of chicken that has like actual hair with okay. their feathers. And then um, just um, this is little red hen. She's another one of our chickens. Kind of, um, we have a few variety breeds. And these are the pigs. And these are pigs, and there's more. This is Spot and Silver, and then we have more piggies back here. We had two mamas actually that had babies. Oh you, wow! Hey, this is Salt. <laughs> and Salt has some babies, and this is Pepper. And <laughs> Salt and Pepper. <laughs> You haven't quite lived life until you have three pigs staring you in the face. I'm from the city, so I'm always a little bit out of my element when I'm around this many animals, but I stay pretty calm. I'm actually impressed with myself, and they're harmless. They're, they're cute animals, you know. You just have to respect their space. We call him Rudolph. See that little spot on his nose that's pink? It was so red when he was born. Mm-hmm. So, hence the name. With the animals, it's um, just therapeutic for kids with disabilities. <laughs> Especially when you get run over by a cow. <laughs> right. People can have a, people can stay a night, a weekend, you know, and uh, stay with the animals, uh, horses, trails. <laughs> oh, it looked like he kind of waved a little bit. Oh, it's the little baby ones. <laughs> Is that like the mom? That's the mom, and the dad's right there behind you. So we're keeping the male separated from the females until they. Oh, this is the male. Yep. So that they we don't have more. Babies. <laughs> is it only for the kids with disability or no. anybody? Anybody welcome? can come. Okay. We try to have special things for our families that have disabilities, but then we also have dates that we welcome all the community to come. This is the wagon. Mm -hmm. Is this the hayride y'all yeah, were talking about? This okay. Is the hayride. I am currently boarding the hayride. This is very cool. <laughs> <laughs> So while I was on the hayride, Cameron gave me some information about the trail, but I'm not going to give you all that. You have to come and see it for yourself. So they just told me they're going to have zip lines back there. I think that's cool. <laughs> <laughs> all right. <laughs> My first time feeding a horse. All right. Yeah. Let's go. Can we give him a, another one? 
All right, got that one quick. <laughs> what is, he what is right? I'm trying to figure this out. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Hey, do your thing. Oh no. There we go. He's like, I'm not letting it fall this time. <laughs> He's a friendly guy. What's his name again? Hinto. Hinto. I like the black and white. It looks like an Indian horse. So we, uh, it's a Native American name. Hinto means blue. Another campfire this area. This is the very first area that we built. It. What is this? It's like a hammock chair. chair. Oh. oh, okay. Really comfy. Yeah. <laughs> I don't want to fall. <laughs> How do you get it? I don't want to fall. I'm scared. <laughs> <laughs> I'm chilling in the hammock at Puzzle Ranch with the horses in the back. This is a whole vibe. Yeah, this is a vibe. So this is cool, they have Puzzle Ranch shirts. And hats. Oh yeah, I noticed the cow print. <laughs> <laughs> That's cool. Yeah. Yep. We have also on the website that uh, helps us raise funds also if anybody wants to you know, support us and get a shirt or a hat or something. They do stuff for the vendors. So it kind of looks like how the festivals look. Correct. Like yeah. when you have a bunch of yeah, people out. Yeah, food trucks, everything, all vendors, local vendors yeah. and stuff like that. It's really fun. And... We're hoping to have everything done, hopefully by the end of summer. We can ask much as we can, we have volunteers. Where do they reach out if they want to volunteer? Um, through social media, we have Facebook and Instagram, but we also have um, our website, puzzleranchflorida.com, mm -hmm. and then email, puzzleranchflorida.com. Of course, I got a wave picture before I left. I want to thank y'all for inviting me out to Puzzle Ranch. I love what y'all are doing for the kids with autism and disabilities. I love that y'all are doing it from a place of passion and not just, you know, for money. Cause I talk a lot about people finding something that they love and pursuing that. And I just love the vision. I love the work that y'all are putting into it. And I can't wait to see what it looks like when it's all done. So <laughs> anything y'all want to say to Lake County? Come and see us. All right. <laughs> so what's for you? 